Welcome back to the Hollywood News Channel, where we update you with the latest news of the day. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Donald Trump Jr. recently claimed that an airport bookseller has not put his book triggered How the Left Drives on Hate and Wants to Silence Us on their shelves, prompting his supporters to ridicule the bookstore's social media accounts. Several friends asked me why they can't find my book triggered at various airport stores. I'm told it's available at a few, but I've been in seven airports this week and haven't seen it. Why not have the number one book? Usual BS, I suppose. Get yours below, the president's son wrote on Twitter Saturday evening. The president's eldest son claimed that Hudson News bookstores are not selling his book released early last month. His book was replaced as the number one nonfiction book on the New York Times bestseller list this week by an anonymous Trump administration official's book cautioning Americans about his namesake father's presidency entitled A Warning. Several recent reports have also emerged which accuse the Republican National Committee of bulk buying triggered in order to inflate sales of the 41-year-old's first book. Last month, the New York Times reported that the Republican National Committee and other GOP allies engaged in the practice of bulk purchasing thousands of copies of Triggered. Federal Election Commission documents reveal that the GOP spent nearly $100,000 in order to push his book to the top of bestseller lists. An additional controversy surrounding the book took place last month after a Los Angeles launch event turned very nasty, causing Trump and his girlfriend Kimberly to flee the venue CNN reported. Staunch supporters of Trump began flooding Hudson News bookseller's social media accounts about his unfounded claim of the book not being stocked. The company did not immediately respond Sunday to Newsweek's request for comment due to the holiday weekend. Pretty ironic that his company refuses to sell a book named Triggered. I have one guess as to why, reads one tweet directed at Hudson Bookseller's most recent post. Looking forward to hearing that you go out of business, reads another Trump minion. Critics pounced on Trump's claim about the airport bookseller, mocking his ability to even write a book, as well as taking a swipe at the RNC inflated purchase reports. I think they are fully stocked in the fiction section, one snarky Twitter user replied to Trump Jr.'s complaint. There are boxes and boxes of them at the RNC, another Twitter commenter wrote. Thank you so much for joining us and see you in the next video. Bye! Thank you for watching the Hollywood News. Don't forget to like and share the updates to the latest information of the day.